Good morning, morning OHS. OHS! And happy Friday! Yeah, so it is the Friday before exam, so I hope you guys are feeling super ready and super prepared for the monster of a week that's coming up. But, so, uh, yeah. For grade nines, it's the last day of your first semester of high school, so that's very exciting. <laughs> <laughs> and for grade twelves, there's only one semester left, so hang wow. in there. <laughs> Um, so let's get started. Yeah, yeah. all right. So um, because it is the Friday before exams, we have one final exam tip for you guys, and that is um, using cue cards can actually be a really great way to study mm -hmm. because not only are you writing the information down on the cue cards, which is a way to study, but then you're also going to use them and verbally like say what's on them. So that's two ways you can actually memorize the information that you're supposed to know. So cue cards are a really great way to go about studying, especially last minute. Oh, definitely. Yeah. So the University of King's College Open House will be Monday, January 30th from 9 a.m. to 1.30 p.m. So come experience a day in the life at King's and you can RSVP today by texting Open House to 770-077. And by now you should be saying that number in your sleep. <laughs> okay. So attention all potential grads looking to study science, math, engineering, or technology. Nominations for the School Lake Leaderships Leader Scholarship are now being accepted in the main office attention to Ms. Kukoski. So this scholarship is open to all students continuing their post-secondary studies in science, technology, engineering, or math with an overall average of at least 85%. Perfect. So for interested students, please submit a 600-word essay demonstrating why you would be a good candidate for the School Lake Leader Scholarship. And intention letters can be submitted to the main office with the attention to Ms. Kukoski, and the deadline for submissions is January 25th. So please see Ms. Kukoski if you have any questions or concerns. Good morning, Oromocto High School. People are asking, how do I make Mr. Jackson's pancakes for him for a special pancake meal? I'm going to tell you. I won't serve these at the Burton Lions Club on Saturday from 8 to 11. I'll serve the better ones. But for Mr. Jackson ones, first you get skull of goat. Now you get rid of the skull, some of the goat, and you put it in there, and that's really good. That adds the protein. You then use an old dish.